Good morning, D.Y. Let's begin our day as always in the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. God knows we need courage these days. And here's something I just saw on Facebook called the six types of courage. Physical courage to keep going with resiliency, balance, and awareness. Social courage to be yourself unapologetically. Moral courage, doing the right thing, even when it's uncomfortable or unpopular. That's uh, sorely needed. Emotional courage, feeling all your emotions. You know, it takes courage just to let yourself feel, to let yourself cry. Intellectual courage, to learn and unlearn and relearn with an open and flexible mind. It takes courage to admit you don't know and to seek. And last but not least, spiritual courage, living with purpose and meaning through a heart-centered approach towards all life and oneself. I find that uh, just great. This uh, coming Sunday is the Feast of the Body and Blood of Christ. And you talk about every kind of courage there is. And, you know, talking about physical courage here, he gave his body and his blood. Think about it. His body is so central to, to this whole faith. And, um, you know, it doesn't say body and mind body and blood, the passion. And you think about spiritual courage, living with purpose and meaning. So this is the day before he's to go to the cross and he ritualizes this and he says, I'm giving myself willingly. And that's what we all do when we go to the altar is that we're offering ourselves, our body, mind, heart, spirit, emotions, all of it, putting it on the altar and offering it to God and offering it to the world in service. And so, you know, courage is such a fundamental virtue. I mean, all the others to, to know what's right and so on, but uh, courage is where the rubber hits the road. So let us pray for the grace of courage. Gracious and loving God, we know that you, you fill us and you give us all that we need. Please help us to embrace the courage that we need to live as you call us to, to love as you call us to. Almighty God, bless us all. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. St. Margaret de Ville, pray for us.